Merry Christmas to everybody. Thanks for tuning on in. And the official as of five o'clock earlier is 9.3 inches of snow that's fallen at the airport. Now, right now, there's still some slick spots overlooking uh, Niles this is our Ainsley heating and cooling weather camera. And you know, temperatures, big story, much cooler. I mean, yesterday at noon, we were sitting into the 50s. Well, right now we're at 18 degrees in Youngstown and those feel like temperatures are much worse than that due to this wind flow. Now, because we're getting that more of a west flow, I don't expect lake effect snow to impact us here in Youngstown or even down in Trumbull or Columbia County, but parts of Trumbull County and really along the Lake Erie uh, corridor, you're going to see some possible inch or two in northern Trumbull and then much more of that along the Lake Erie corridor. Now, wind chill, four degrees feel like temperature outside Youngstown, Mansfield at zero, and these wind chills are going to stick around at least through tomorrow, but we'll have a uh, temperature bounce heading into the week, and I'll get into the details out here in a few moments. Storm track uh, radar picking up some light flurries over in Mercer County, but really along that corridor of uh, the lake shore, you can see darker blues, and I do expect that to impact uh, some areas of Ashtabula, Erie, along that area is mainly uh, east of Cleveland. Now, that's why they still have a winter storm warning for parts of uh, northern of Trumbull County, but in Trumbull County, there's a winter, winter weather advisory to some possible lake effect. Now, there's a chance about maybe another additional inch or two in northern Trumbull here in Youngstown. Um, maybe a half an inch is possible, but for tonight, temperatures cold, 14 for your low. Like I said, it was going to be windy conditions throughout the night tonight and heading into tomorrow. Futurecast is going to be picking up on those flurries heading into Saturday, but even though the chance is low, there is a chance for some flurry early morning on Saturday. And then on the back half of Saturday, some sunshine. Sunday is more of a better day temperature wise. See upper 30s with sunshine on the back half of that day as well. High tomorrow is 27 degrees. Snow showers possible early on, but seven day forecast for this weekend. It's not bad for Sunday. That's my pick of the week. High of 40 degrees and then Tuesday we'll see some sunshine, but cooler uh, temperatures and then we are tracking another system for Wednesday and Thursday. Thursday is looking like a washout, mostly rain, and then we're going to see another plummet in temperatures high of 32 for the New Year's Day with some possible snow flurries, uh, Madison. So you just got to get through uh, today and tomorrow and then temperatures will rebound.